Hey and welcome to this tutorial. In this video, I'm showing you how to create a pricing table with the help of free Elementor plugin and a Jet Elements add-on. You can get this add-on on templatemaster.com or on Elementor Marketplace, that is on templatemaster.com slash Elementor Marketplace. Just scroll down the page and find the section with Elementor WordPress plugins. We can also explore more add-ons for Elementor. Here on the live preview for Jet Elements, you can find the examples of the designs that you can create with the help of this add-on. The creation of person tables with the help of Jet Elements is easy and you can see all the changes you apply in real time. So now let me show you how you can create a simple design with the help of this plugin. Now let's go and create a new section, then go to the elements and you can simply type the pricing table widget in the search bar and then drop it onto a new section. And what it's going to do is to insert a one column design of the pricing table item. If you want to add three or four or even two of them, you can do so just adding one column at a time. So you can use an icon, add a title, a subtitle, and also make this item featured, adding a badge that you can add as an image. So it looks like that. Here we can type in the price, the features that go as items like so and there is also a difference between included and excluded items and you'll be able to customize their look separately in the style tab later and the action button as well so we can change the text and add the url and also add some text before the action button now let's go to the style tab and see what style settings we've got in there Like so, here we can customize the header and add a separate background color to the header only. Like that. Here goes the icon color, so you can also customize the look of your icon. Again, you can highlight the section using different background color. So uh, in this case, your price consists of three parts. It's a prefix, price value and suffix. Prefix meaning the sign of the currency that you are using. Then the value and then per month is going to be as a suffix. I'm not going to change it right now, but you see that you can tweak and customize a lot of features. So now here go the features, you can also add a background tweak the typography and as I've said you have different and separate settings for included features and excluded features. So you can set different colors so users will see right away that these features go within this package or whatever you're selling and these features don't and they can also go with an icon that you can select action box is the bottom part of this column so you can choose the background color So if you have some text in there, you can also customize the typography. And here are the settings for the action button. Like so, 
and you've got one section pre-designed and what I would do is to duplicate this column as many times as you need and just change the values that you have in the fields having the same design as in the first column you can also make one of the columns stand out just adjusting the margin of the given column so this one is a little bit wider than other two and it's got minus 33 on the top margin so now you see how easy creating a pricing table is with the help of Elementor Page Builder and Jet Elements add-on. Don't forget to go to the description box down below and check the links to these products. If you like the video, leave a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching!